x5p.com. Use code CUTE at checkout. Link down below me buying coins off the website is a very short and to the point video to help you save your money. Right now, prices are down, so go get the coins before prices go back up. Right now, 500k is below $14 when you use code Q. All right, guys, we are back. Best player each position. Now, I do at least three videos a day, so subscribe if you're new. I already did the Hollywood AKA card. Go watch it. He's posted right now. And I just did the top 10 wide receivers. Now let's get to the best at each position. Left tackle. Okay. So there's like no reason to spend 700K here, 500K here. Just go get Armstead. Now, Armstead's going to give you, as you can see, edge protector for zero. That's all you need. Um, left guard. There's no reason to get Russ. Just get Cleveland. Cleveland is just fine. Identifier for zero. And it's a good protector for one. So there's your identifier for free right there. For my new people don't know what that is, that just shows you who the defense is using. So, center. I'm not going to tell you to spend 600K. I'm going to tell you to spend 300K right here. I'm going to tell you to go get Red Tornado because why? He gets his own chemistry. Okay. Um, this guy is going to be able to help your team more. And with his abilities, putting Secure Protector for one, you can give a post up or a natural talent for zero. He's going to do just fine as the other ones. Right guard, it's going to be um, Austin. Austin right here is going to be just fine. Secure Protector for one. And you can get Polar Elite also because he's so fast. So if you need a guy to pull, he is like the fastest guard. That's why I'm picking him. And we're picking Tristan. Why Tristan? Because, well, he's the only player that gets edge protected for zero. So he's the best, right? Up next. <laughs> Up next, guys, we got the unicorn. Unicorn's got some speed, got some size, breaks tackles, jumps over people. He's great. All right. Um, this guy here is going to be the best receiving one. And then... If you needed a more of a well-rounded guy, I would suggest to go get Walker. Walker blocks way better, but he's only 6'2". So he's basically another wide receiver out there. He does well. He's been on my team for a while. I really like this card. Um, short out and short in. He gets both for one AP total. So if you need a torch man defense, you go get him. But Unicorn guys right now, the animations he gets and stuff is just stupid. And at... Wide receiver here. You know who I'm trying to type in. It's Drake. Drake right here breaks so many tackles. It's just stupid. He runs you pull over. He, his animations are just dumb. Okay. I, I break two tackles and run in the end zone with him. He's just crazy. Up next. Where is he at? There he is. Right here. You can get 98 speed on him at the Super Bowl strat. He's amazing. 6'4". He's not gonna break tackles, but man, 98 speed stock, he runs by people. He he can really, really do well with the jump ball. I really like this card, he's very shifty as well. And then the next one we're gonna give you is gonna be Carmichael, of course. This guy's a jump ball guy, he's gonna run people over. Um, he's great, I really like him. And I do wanna put somebody in here to remind you guys uh, that who is really good. Scary Terry is amazing, um, right here, his abilities. Short out for zero, short in for one. His abilities are great. You want to torch me and even go get Scary Terry. He'll surprise you how good he is. Up next, Perry and Allstott. Really, Perry's going to be the better runner. And then Allstott, well, I don't know. I would say Perry's just better overall. Um, I wouldn't spend one million coins on him. But just for saying the best overall, I'm going to say it's Perry because of the speed, his running and his blocking total. Now, quarterback's pretty easy. It's gonna be Sandcastle. Um, he's better than Brady. Why? Because of his release. His release is way better. Um, and, well, his discounts are great too. I know Brady has great discounts, but as far as having the same stats, no, they don't. He's way faster. He feels faster. He's more shifty. You can, you can spin this guy. He, you can spin Brady, okay, it doesn't feel very good. And this guy here is just going to be a better runner with a better release. He's just better. 
And then, uh, of course, when you got the running back, you got the king. King is still king, of course. His X factor is speed. He has good uh, abilities. And yeah, he's still the king at running back for sure. Free safety is Sandcastle. Now, if you wanted a guy to throw hit sticks, this is not going to be your guy, all right, at all. But as far as a coverage guy, this is going to be your guy. He's the best coverage safety in the game. He's aggressive. He cuts off routes. This guy is so fast. You can't outrun him. You get 99 speed on him very easily. Uh, this guy is very aggressive. Um, you know who I really like? He's been just going crazy for me. He's Rodney Harrison. Um, he gets... He's like the best deep ball safety in the game. You can get deep route KO on him. You can get deep out zone. I mean, you can get pick artists here, but you can get deep route zone right here. So he gets discounts all the way down to tier three. He's aggressive. He throws hit six by himself. He really jumps routes. He pays attention. Unlike if you guys use John Lynch when he came out, he was horrible. Um, right here, we're gonna go Rod. Rod is great. He actually is just more well-rounded. He doesn't have a great power move, but his finesse move helps him get off the edge here. He's 600K, so his price has dropped. He gets Lurker, pick artists. I mean, this guy here is gonna be good at run stopping. He's gonna be good at coverage. He's gonna be good at everywhere. That's why he's there. Number one middle linebacker is gonna be Jalen Smith, secure tackler here. You can get Lurker for zero, and you can get I mean, his discounts and his, it's how good he is overall with his speed, his block shed, and his zone being 90, that's a threshold. So he can cover, he can lurk with them, and he can defend the run. So he's amazing. Up next, Junior Seau. This guy here is not as good as Smith, but he's good. Lurker for zero is nice. Secure tackler for one, so King and Quad's going down first time. And you can get pick artists if you want to, if you're going to leave them in coverage. Uh, you can put different things, obviously. Haley is going to be the best outside here. Um, edge threat for one is amazing. Double nothing for zero is important. And then you can even add speedster. Tackle Supreme's great. You can add a lot of things to him. As far as a blitzer, he's definitely going to be the best one for the left outside. Cornerback. Mel Blunt is going to be the guy. 6'3", he's fast. He throws hit sticks by himself, so he can change a game. He's aggressive, he's big. I really like him inside shape for two, that means you can put him in man. And right here, you can get anything from deep to mid to short, he can cover the whole field. Pick artists for zero is what you like to see. And in a corner here, I'm gonna tell you Slay, his abilities are crazy, right? Outside shape for one, you can get pick artists here. You can get short right high over here. You can go outside shade for one all the way to his third ability. So he is going to be amazing. And then, you know who I like right here? I like Rhodes. Rhodes is 6'1", and he's fast. And he gets crazy abilities flat right here. And then you can go even deep right here. So he does everything pretty well. I really like that card. And I also like... Um, Hall. If you guys have not tried Hall, you probably haven't. He's really expensive. Pick artist for zero. Um, Hall's on my team right now, and I, that's who my starting left side of my, my D-backs are. He's very aggressive and good. I really like him. He's not the biggest, but he reacts well. Left in, um, it is going to be the new card Tank, actually. Uh, tank gets something that you cannot counter, and that is going to be right here. Unstoppable force. Okay. You can get um, right right here. Persistent on him to really help keep it activated. He does get edge threat elite, of course. And you can put deflator if you want. Now, who else is gonna be good right here? It's gonna be Milkman because they get the same abilities, right? That's why Milkman is so dominant. It's not because of anything else but his X Factor. And he gets unstoppable force. So he's going behind D-Law because D-Law is just faster and he's going to be able to get to the quarterback and that can cost you one step, two steps here. Either the ball goes in the ground or he gets sacked or he gets rid of it. So it's very important. D-Law is a huge upgrade over Milkman. Over here, that's going to be Freeney. Freeney, he gets double or nothing for zero and an extra lead for one. That's a good combo. 
Um, and if you really want to put them in inside, no outsiders for 1 AP, it's really helping like against a stretch. Inside stuff is nice. Um, defense right here, I'm going to tell you right now. Um, mean Joe Green has performed the best for me all year. Uh, inside stuff for one, and you can do double or nothing for one. Just his speed and animations. Even if you guys use his AKA card, AKA card, his animations are crazy. He was still noticeable months after he came out, and he's still good. Do not ever forget about the Grave Digger. All right, Grave Digger right here. Yes, yes, please. He's the only player in the game that gets. Where is it? Uh, secure attack clip for zero. Only player in the game. Okay. So it means King and Quad's going down first time. He's really good. I really like him. That's going to do it for me, guys. Be kind of on a reason to help each other, encourage each other. If you want a kicker, go get Matt Gay um, because, well, he has 96 kick power. The next one is 93. That can save you a game, right? It really could. Just a tip right there. Uh, maybe those few yards you were short and you could have. Probably not, but just if you want the best, get the best. This team only costs 18 million. That's a bargain. That's be kind for no reason. Help each other, encourage each other. Try to get there as fast as possible. If this helped you, hit the like button. Go watch Holly, what he's up right now in the top 10 wide receivers are as well. Be kind for no reason. I'll see you in the next video.